Hello everyone, it's Riley and welcome to another episode of the King Hearts Playthrough. This episode we're going to be doing Halloween Town. Hopefully everyone's recovered after the horror that was Atlantica. I'm actually quite looking forward to Halloween Town. It's at the top of one of my favourites. Not as good as Neverland, but I like it. Something different. New style of clothing as well. It's not as if we have a bloody dolphin, shark, merman tail this time. We just have a really cool Halloween outfit. This sure is a spooky place. I love Sora's Halloween outfit. It's so cool. <laughs> so, we're level 34. Hopefully that'll be enough for this world. Um... Everything's still the same as last episode. I was planning on doing some levels, but then I was just like, no, let's just go straight into it. So this might be a two-parter. I may come back if I get stuck. Don't know how this is going to go yet, though. We'll find out. Oh, they were kind of lazy when they came to animating the mayor. Thank you, thank you. But their movement still needs work. It's not scary enough. I want to strike bone chilling terror. I'm going to consult the doctor. I'm going to consult the doctor. Then I'll go attend to the decorations. Right, now we need to find the doctor's laboratory. Which I believe is this way. Any treasure chests? No. I don't understand. Maybe the guidance system was damaged. In I always got lost in Halloween Town when I first played Game of My devices are all. Also, I'm filming this really late, so that's today's excuse for being tired. Oh, I've got it. Why, of course. The heartless need a heart. Doctor, do you think we can add a heart to that device? Certainly. A heart's not all that complicated. Ah, let's get to work. To make a heart. First, take a container with a lock. We need the key to this thing first! That's where Sora comes in. <laughs> Donald Yen being really worried. I want to see the Heartless Dance too. <laughs> don't know. No, I don't, Sora. My, that was amazing! Uh, and you are... Sora. Well done, Sora. I'd like you to be a part of this year's Halloween. What's this Heartless doing here? Oh, a special little bomb. so came cute. To town just Both as naive as each other. What's frustrating is I can't get them to dance with me. So, the doctor and I are trying to improve the guidance system. He's quite a genius. Okay, doctor, let's continue. The ingredients for a heart. Pulse. Emotion. Terror. Fear. Hope and despair. Mix them all together, and we have a heart. Leaves. 
Nope, not today. Maybe we're missing some ingredients. Let's try adding memory. Sally? Sally! Hi. Good for nothing girl. Don't know why I bothered creating her. Sally's got the memory we need. See if you can track her down. No problem. Sora, would you like to come along? Sure. <laughs> Donald, no. We are not doing that. Donald's like a really defensive parent. <laughs> I thought I needed to check there. I had a feeling. Jack! Jack! We have a major crisis! A major crisis! The heartless are completely out of control! We when can't they not? stop them! Hmm, maybe our experiment triggered something. Everything will be fine, Mayor. You have nothing to worry about. Donald, mm-hmm. I'm telling you this. Donald just needs to sit down. I honestly can't remember everything you have to do in that town. I, I can remember some of it. All I know is that I have a habit of getting lost. As I do in most worlds. So seeing as the next ones are kind of more puzzle based and location based, it's gonna be a bit bit of a up and down ride. That's the warning I'm giving everyone now. Hopefully not as bad as that has to get though. Oh, I love Zero. Look at his little face. Zero, have you seen Sally anywhere? No. Ah. Is something wrong, Jack? No, everything's going great. We're going to have the best Halloween ever. All we need now is your memory. Memory? You mean this? I never got that reference until recently. Jack, I have a bad feeling about this. Why don't you try something else? There's still time. Nothing could beat what I've got planned. Once we give the Heartless a heart, they'll dance just as I envision it. Trust me, you're going to love it. <laughs> Even Sally knows. There's a lot of that in this. This series already. Hmm, hmm, hmm. <laughs> oh dear. That's so annoying. Yeah, I sure did. So uh, annoying. What should we do? Gosh, you really are stupid. Isn't it obvious? Tell Oogie Boogie. Tell Oogie Boogie. <laughs> I always get South Park vibes off them. I don't know why. I love the little cartoon avatars that we've got going on. And the fact that they're really high quality is also very nice. Yes, this is it. 
Now just one more ingredient. <laughs> okay, okay. Probably one of the most stupidest villains, but so quirky and funny at the same time. That works for me. I'll be jigging. <laughs> Ooh, when I get my hands on that, well, I've got no hands. Got no hands. But I'm still gonna nab that heart and control the heartlet. <laughs> I didn't actually know who Oogie Boogie was when I first played Kingdom Hearts. I was a bit confused, and then obviously when I watched the film, I found out more about it. I was like, oh, okay, this makes sense now. See, learning things from Kingdom Hearts is always good. One heartless is knocked out in the background doing its thing. Okay, where is it? We need to go. Is it in here? Yes, it is. So, to my knowledge, we need to remember yeah, the ghost and the tombstone. I don't see the first two. Unless it is just those two. Yeah. Okay, one, two, three. Is that it? All that for a jack-in-the-box, what's the point? What is the point? Okay, right, how... Okay, we get back through the door. Oh. Okay, well, we need to... Fire! I mean, technically we can because we've got magic now, but yeah. Also, we only need one more torn page now worked out until we can actually technically do um, the blue roll completely fine. So, after Halloween Town, what I might do is I might go back to some worlds, try and collect the rest of the Dalmatian puppies that we need to get. Um, enough to unlock the prize of the last piece of tape and then we'll do and I know it's not really that important to the story but I like what happens at the end of it and I kind of want to see that and see the details of that yeah in um, the PlayStation 4 edition This time it's sure to work. Great. 
chase after the kids. Ugh, we lost them. Lost them. <laughs> Sora looks so passive aggressive. Ah, zero. Zero. After them, quick. Quick. <laughs> Is it going to be the creepy bath? Oh, excuse me. Don't get me wrong. It's cool. But it creeps me out. The bath creeps me out. I could never do the MX first time, so maybe in this playthrough it will be different. <laughs> Just casually walk across. It's going well. Going well. Stupid death. I don't want one of them for a while. I'll go back to my earlier saying we may have trouble with the solo still. Doctor, I'm hoping you'll be okay. Then again, I said that in that answer as well. And we all know what happened there. Take that! Uh, that's it! 
struck again because uh, video editing that was a blooming nightmare like my laptop I think it knew how much I hated it so it took five hours to finish rendering that one out it was just not a good time at all I've never rage quit a game so quickly I always get lost here. I knew. Okay, so I'm hoping I'll be okay. But I always get lost. Or fall off. So I'm conscious of that as well. This is it! This is it! Oh, no, 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 you're off. Bye. Sorry, you're gone. Come on. Okay, go. No one else. Exactly. Game. Game plays. Yeah, but no puppies. We need the puppies. Fire! Oh, what? Good. I was gonna say. Oh, and look, I fall off. It's going well, as normal. It's going well. What is this? 
Remember how I said stupid purposes? We came very close then. We were just following orders. Oogie Boogie told us to seal the hearts. All Barrel's fault. It was his idea to tell Oogie Boogie about the heart. Yeah, that's right. But, but, but you guys said... You should be ashamed. Mm, it sounds like the relationship between Don, Goofy and Sora, if I'm honest. <laughs> if I'm honest. Fabulous. So that's that all done. Where do we have to go now? Yes, there is. I thought that might have been the case. I was like thinking, like, that couldn't. No, I think we meant to have a cutscene. Okay, now we've just got to find the place. Kids have anything to say. You'll never find the green door. Yeah. I don't think we will. This is annoying. Because, like, the first one I found it originally, like, 
one of the first times I played Kingdom Hearts. I, I think I just fell down and stumbled upon it. So it was pure chance. Something tells me that isn't going to happen again. Falling down. It works every time. <laughs> oh dear. I didn't actually expect that to happen. Oogie Boogie, give me back the heart. You want it? Well, now watch me die because I didn't expect it. to find the door. I didn't equip any items. Watch it happen. <laughs> Let's see if I can get their attention. Oh, this isn't going to go down well. None of it. How any like? I think it's two. Yeah, two show up. This is it. Nobody disrespects me. Nobody. Nobody. Right. As I say, this is going to go well.
was really worried we weren't going to be able to hit him then. I don't know why it's Halloween Town easier than Atlantica. I know it's probably the level thing. But how? Why? Oh, you can actually see the eyes in this one. I think just want Sora to squish it. Obtained holy circle it and some report seven. You just walk home, everything's fine, everything's dandy. Turn around, however. my favourite part of Halloween Town. Because although it's a boss fight, it's a really cool boss fight. Now, I don't really know where we're going. So, I'm just going to be annoying in it as well. It's almost like a square he's got forward. And it's like, yeah, let's just make Oogie Boogie control the house with the power of darkness. No, no, no. Just when you think it's all going well, you fall off. like a um, Donkey Kong type thing where you've got to keep climbing up like Mario did to save Princess Peach. Which is kind of cool. I was worried I was going to make that jump then. Complex level design. There we go. 
See, good boss fight that is. But why is it quicker than Atlantica? Is it because Atlantica technically isn't part of the story? So they're just like, we're just going to throw in a really difficult boss. Yeah, I'm not saying it's difficult, but it's difficult for me. But still, to this day, I don't like that boss fight. The good thing is, any treasure that we didn't get inside of Oki Prison's Man is going to suddenly drop to the floor. So it's just going to be in a massive circle, and you'll get it later. Why are you stood there when a mansion's collapsing? Why? Standard keyhole, really, you know? It is a very good ceiling animation for how it's like reflecting. Yes, gravity upgrade. Sally, why didn't I listen to you? Don't feel bad, Jack. We'll come up with another plan for Halloween. Next time, we'll do it together. Yeah, a new keyblade. <laughs> Sounds like Zeno. What is a heart? I can't figure it out. Little did we know at the time. So, what is this? Well, we're going to use that because it's slightly more powerful. Can we equip anything else? Nope, still not. Still not ready yet. So now we're at the level that we should have been when we took on Atlantica. Apparently. 37, 38 is what it's recommended to be. Save and head back to the gummy ship. Fab! So that's this episode of the King of Hearts playthrough done, guys. Next time we'll be going to my favourite world, which is Neverland. Or we may possibly be doing the 100 Acre Wood, depending if I can find some Dalmatian puppies in the meantime. But until the next episode, guys, if you enjoyed this, give it a big thumbs up, and I will see you in the next one. <laughs>